Hej. Hey everybody, welcome to the show. Um, I'm Glasses. And this is Ginger. And we're playing Grim Fandango! Sorry for the wait, Mr. Flores. I am ready to take you now. Take me? Take me where? Now, now. There's no need to be nervous. Nervous? No. It's just your appearance. It's a little intimidating. Intimidating? Me? But I'm your friend. My name's Manny Calavera. I'm your new travel agent. I don't want a new travel agent. I want to go home. <laughs> you can't go home, Celso. You're dead. But you're not alone. Everybody here is just as dead as you. That's why we call it the land of the dead. Are you ready for your big journey? No. What journey? The four-year journey of the soul. It is quite a big trip. And I can't lie to you, Celso. It could be very, very dangerous. Unless you were to take that money you were buried with and buy a better travel package from us. I mean, wouldn't you rather cross the land of the dead in your own sports car? Maybe try a luxury ocean cruise? Or, if you led a very good life, you may even be eligible for a ticket on the number nine itself. The number nine? That's our top-of-the-line express train. It shoots straight to the ninth underworld, the land of eternal rest, in four minutes instead of four years. But very few people qualify. Let's take a look at your records. Hmm? Mm. <laughs> well, the bad news is the train appears to be just out of your reach, but I still got a couple of tricks up my sleeve here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, ha! Yes, that's the ticket. The Excelsior Line. Yes, she's a beauty. That compass in the handle will sure come in handy, too. Oh, you're going to have a great trip. Wish I was going. Why don't you? You could give me a lift. Oh, I can't leave here until I've worked off a little debt to the powers that be. Community service, eh? Well, I guess there are some folks worse off than me. Oh, I'll be leaving here soon enough. No thanks to dead and no commission low-life cases like yours, Menso. Hey, Manny. The boss told me to tell you not to leave early tonight. He wants to talk to you about something when he gets back from his trip. Tell Don not to worry. I'm not going anywhere. Especially so not sad. with clients like that. <laughs> Where do they get these guys? They don't qualify for anything good, so I can't sell anything good. Can't work off my time and I'm stuck. Stuck selling walking sticks to a bunch of burros for eternity. I need better clients. I need a real saint. I need a lead on a rich, dead saint. Well, don't we all? Hmm. ¿Qué es esto? Right, guys. So sorry to keep you hanging there. Um, you know, without descriptions, this is a completely new game. Grim Fandango. Ever played this, Ginger? I have never played this game. I've never played this game either. So, <laughs> couple of issues. Uh, we don't know how to pause here. I'm gonna try to pause. Doesn't work. I'm gonna try P. Doesn't work. Escape. So yeah, well, we can check key bindings, but there's probably no pause. So here's the trick. Um, we can use escape, but it will, you know, end the cutscene. Yeah, so it's yeah. not what we want to do. So here's the story, guys. Maybe you got some of the hints, maybe not. The thing is, our hero is a skeleton. <laughs> He's dead, right? <laughs> And the other guy he was talking to was also a skeleton, dead guy, yeah. who presumably just kicked the bucket. Oh, that's a nice way to say it. That's not a nice way to say it, sorry. So, who just recently passed away, and he probably needs to traverse to the land of the dead, or undead, or whatever. And uh, basically there are several means of travel, <laughs> and because he had no money on him, what he got from our hero, Manny Calavera, Cavalera, Calavera, whatever, was a walking cane with a compass. Good luck. <laughs> but <laughs> we learned that for some reason, Ginger, Manny is stuck where he is. Yeah. And we're probably going to find out more. So, Manny, when he talks to his clients, he had this Undertaker costume. Um, you know, he had the black. Um, cape. The black cape and everything, and a, and a sight. 
But now he has, you know, just uh, a standard corporate suit and red tie. He's bald. That's usual for skeletons. No hat. And we we're seeing his office, right, Ginger? I, I think so, yeah. It's quite big. There is a table in the middle of the room and there are two chairs, red chairs. Next to the table there is a... no, maybe three. There's an armchair next to the There's an armchair, as right. Well. Two it's chairs orange. and an armchair. There is a lamp on the table, which is turned on. And there are many shelves. Yeah, with on, case and yeah, files. On the left side. And there is also a pipe or something like that, maybe. I think it's uh, the pipe, pipe post. Yeah, with a flag, red yeah. flag on it. That means probably you've got an email. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> and so many smoking, if you if you hear... <sighs> yeah, he's smoking, him, he's right. Sailing. Um, smoking's bad for your health, but I guess if you're dead, it kind of <laughs> yeah, it doesn't no matter anymore. Matters, right? I think so. So, and again, this game completely new to us guys, so even the controls and everything. So we'll be fumbling a little bit, perhaps. Well, let's check out what's in the room. So we know we have an email. Let's check it out first. What do I do? I click and I oh, look. Oh, there's a new menu. Looks like I got a message. Yeah. All right. Better message than massage. <laughs> or the other way around. Um, let's open. Yeah, I think so. Open, take. It's some sort of special work order. To all agents from office manager Don Copel. All right, you boneheads, thank you lucky stars and get to your friggin' cars. We have a mass poisoning on our hands. Too many dead to assign specific cases, so all clients are first come, first serve. So let's see some hustle out there. Whatever you say, Hiffy. All right, that's our opportunity, right? We yeah, need to grab some that, that's true. rich dad guy. <laughs> that feels really weird. I mean, you know, <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to make any gender prejudices or anything. <laughs> but like, true. I have never played anything like this before. Really weird. <laughs> so, guys, we'll be trying our best during the cutscenes um, to, to provide a commentary, but the dialogue is really dense and yeah, really fast. Yeah, I think we can describe it afterwards. So we'll probably either describe before or afterwards. Some jokes may be lost, right? Um, hopefully not. Hopefully, with time, you know, you will learn to recognize the different voices of different characters yeah. but uh, you know if it's lost to you we're sorry we're, we're trying our best anyway so what else is in the office that we can work with ginger the cases and the case files let's try let's try I don't want to reread the old files it'll just make me sad <laughs> okay for sure there's something that looks there's like a, a fridge but it's probably a shelf. shelf we can look at it to find out what it is my computer gives me instant access to our database of deadbeats. Right, it's a computer. Can we use it? Hey! Yes. Here's Celso's file. That walking stick was too good for him. <laughs> <laughs> so here's one thing we did not tell you. The, the overall atmosphere of the game is like 60s, 70s. Yeah, yeah, that's true. What is like? I'm I'm really bad with dates, so no, I, I think you know, so. 60, 70, something yeah. like that. There's the old furniture. Um, the computer is quite old. We can check more of the office, maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah. Just uh, switch to a different camera. It's bigger than we thought. There's, There's another a table, table with full of many books. books. This looks like a stamp. It's yeah, a deck of cards. Oh, it's a deck of cards. Let's uh, pick it up. Yeah, I think. Okay. Better take these cards. It looks like a long day of solid there for me. <laughs> <laughs> so now we have a new icon here in the interface. Um, I don't feel like what? pitching cards right now. Oh. That probably uses the last picked up item and then we can check the inventory. Um, which has many reach into his suit. Yeah. Where he has what? My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Oh. <laughs> so that's handy. And apart from the scythe, we have... It's some sort of special it? work order. Oh, we've that's got the, the letter. the email, yeah. Mail. <laughs> no, email. This afraid around the edges. Then again, so am I. And I've got fewer suits. 
And, and so the deck of cards has a okay. skeleton on it, okay. of course. And that's all we have, presumably. Hey, here's an ace. Need to mark these cards. Oh, why would you mark your cards? <laughs> right. To cheat? Hey, I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know, Ginger, so... <laughs> My boss books. is always giving me these motivational sales books. They bought the farm, now sell them the cows. Stuff like that. <laughs> Can we take the book? Yeah, we read them use already. Them. Didn't help. <laughs> okay. Read them already. Didn't help. <laughs> All right. So. No, there is nothing on the couch. Else, what else can we do? How, how do we go back here? Right here. What else can we interact with? Maybe that's all. The computer, I don't really know yeah, what to do with it. already done the computer. Um, so let's leave the room? I think so. What do yeah. I think? You know, looking outside looks a little bit like, you know, whatever. A city. There is a New city. New York or yeah. San Fran. But it looks like Empire State. A little bit. What's outside the window? But hard to say. We are leaving our office. Let's hunt for those clients. Oh, warning. <laughs> this game does not automatically save. Please save in the pause menu to avoid losing progress. Well, we eh. indeed didn't save as well. No, but we got we got used to all the modern things. So I'm going to save here okay. fairly often because I have no idea like how often we need save. Um, and so we see hallway, right? Yeah, there is someone in the back of the hallway. I think it's a woman, maybe. I think it's a woman we heard in the yeah. intro uh, talking to us. And and she said the boss will want to talk to us later Maybe. on. Maybe. There is a red um, carpet on the floor. Of and course, red carpet. Well, <laughs> yeah. like, prestigious agency, right? <laughs> There's one more door. The ceiling is the ceiling. made of gold. I think yeah. it's bronze, but it looks it's like the gold. Or vintage architecture. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Real vintage here. Yeah. And, you know, the what's the color of the walls? It's... Um, Turquoise. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll believe you. And, uh, Something and there's like door and the door like... Yeah. Um, how do you call it? You're the, you're the art. Vitrage, huh? Vitrage. Well, vitrage, right? You, it's French. Find the dictionary. So let's try walking to the door. Yeah, we can. We Domino's can do door that. is locked. Probably scared Domino's off to get one door. of his files. Not a bad idea, actually. <laughs> So, so Domino is either the boss, or maybe, or or another uh, like Cody, competitor. You, you, yeah, mm -hmm. I I have this feeling I want to save like every second, but like it's okay. Let's talk to. Her name is gonna be Doris. I'm gonna bet. I don't remember from the intro. Hey, look, uh, what a nice skeleton lady. <laughs> <laughs> so what we see is a corner with the reception. Nice little skeleton lady who has red hair. Um, and a with, funny bun. Yeah, with a ponytail that's actually yeah. <laughs> at the front and aiming upwards. <laughs> a little weird. I think she's sporting glasses. Yeah, I is, think is so. She? And uh, then there is like a jukebox behind her, a statue, and there's one more door, oh. gold door, maybe the boss's door. And of course, she has a typewriter that she can hear, and she's got a, a bronze pipe post next to her. Yeah. So let's make friends here. Let's talk. Let's look at her first. Let's look at her. Let's appreciate it. <laughs> okay. It's my boss's secretary, Ava. It's my boss's whipping boy, Manny. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hey, Ava. Nice to meet you, too. Buenos dias. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? What poisoning? Oh, any messages for me? Busy as ever, I see. Oh, well, I gotta go hit the bricks. Uh, what poisoning? What poisoning? The code three gazpacho poisoning that everybody's after you. Why do <laughs> I, I send out memos pacho. if nobody reads them? Well, where was the poisoning where again? Where was the poisoning again? <laughs> Just ask your driver for crying out loud. He'll know. Okay, well, so we have a driver. I forget. Am I am I supposed to be somewhere right now? Uh, I forget. Am I supposed to be somewhere right now? Manny, do I have to explain your job to you again? Yes. Yes. Oh, the option is actually there. <laughs> we have there. the option. Or we can say no, but I'd like to hear your description of it just for kicks. Or no, I just want to know where my driver is. 
Well, yes, I want to hear yes, the scripture. Yes, I want right? to hear everything. Because we don't know anything we about the game. Yes. Right. Well, Give us the, the lore. Well, the man more than I know picks up people in the land of the living. Dead people? Preferably. And he brings them here and tries valiantly to sell them the best travel package they qualify for. If he sells them enough premium packages, our hero will be free to leave the land of the dead. Until then, he and I are stuck here having the same conversation over and over again for eternity. Well, enough about me. What's your job like? Or what if we just skip down tonight? <laughs> <laughs> Why do some clients qualify for better travel packages? Or, well, I gotta go hit the brakes. Well, I think everything's quite important and, and it's super interesting i mean <laughs> yeah, why are yeah. we stuck here while the yeah. clients just you know come and maybe we don't have the money like i don't know but let's ask about her job right? yeah well enough about me what's your job like like babysitting except i don't get to watch tv <laughs> <laughs> all right so let's ask about so so there is a new option yeah. she says he's sorry he says Manny says, so what did you do in life to get stuck here? I so what know. did you do in life to get stuck here? What I did back in the fat days is none of your business. You know the rules. Well, we don't. Well, we don't, <laughs> we don't have there, there are rules, really? Yeah. <laughs> Why do some clients qualify for better travel packages? They led good lives. Good tries. How do you define a good life? Better than yours and mine. Okay, maybe this is the reason we are stuck there. <laughs> I have no idea. So, let's ask you for a date. Yeah. What if we just skip down tonight? You and me, baby. Well, thanks for the offer, but we'd never make it out of the city alive. But... In one piece, I mean. I bet I could get you out if I really tried. Oh, Manny, look at you. You're a trapped soul and you don't even know it. Okay. Right. So, let's ask about the messages yeah. and the yeah. messages for me. Besides Explore the one more. about the poisoning? Yeah. I only have one other message for you, Manny. Uh -oh. I'm not your secretary. I don't take <laughs> your messages. So get oh. it through your thick skull and stop forwarding your phone to me. <laughs> All right. Sorry. But that sounded more like four messages to me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. <laughs> hey, no, no, no. <laughs> we, can, we, can, we can make her angry a little bit. In my heart, though, you're still my secretary. Let's do that. In my heart, though, you're still my secretary. Manny, what are you talking about? I was never your secretary, even when you were on top. I got one boss, same as you, Don Copel. All right. Come on, I know you work for another man besides Don. It's <laughs> really yeah, weird. The dialogue is quite... <laughs> Come on, I know you work for another man besides Don. What, what, what are you talking about? I know you take memos for Hurley sometimes. Ah, oh, Manny, just beat it, will ya? Oh, here we go. Oh, I right. think we've checked well, it all. I gotta go hit the bricks. Okay, you show those bricks a lesson. <laughs> right, let me um see if we can open the, those door. Big Mr. Boss Ooh. Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. I don't like. I'm dead. What is he gonna do to me, right? Yeah, that's true. All right, let's walk out here. So, a, a little scene where we see front of um, what was the name again? Eva's uh -huh. desk, and there is a paper there. Okay, it's a hole punch. Oh, it's hole punch. Let's take it. Could I take your hole punch? Ha! I doubt you could take my half punch. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> that was a little brutal. Mind if Can I use, use your hole punch? Knock yourself out. Okay. Thanks. Oh, he's Gets the so many just out, uh, doesn't it? <laughs> slammed it twice. I wonder if, if we can put a hole into one of our cards. Not that, you know, there'd be a reason for it, but like, let's try what does we'll do select Manny what yes. are you doing just marking cards honey <laughs> why would he want to know yeah <laughs> Cheating, but... Well, he said that right yeah. earlier on. He said it like I I'm looking for a way to mark those cards. Like, I know, I know. Should we also mark uh, the rest of them? Maybe he said <laughs> no, no, the side. The the inventory is a little weird. I mean, it's quite hard to navigate in it. Yeah, because you only see away and not much else. Okay. One item. Sorry, not the memo. Hey, Danny, come back here, boy. I the inventory is crazy. It's gonna drive That's me crazy. Weird. The cards. Use the cards. Any more holes and it would fall apart. Okay. All right, the ace is enough. Right, yes, we're gonna leave here. Put the card back into your suit, and a beautiful 60s, 50s, maybe even elevator. 
So, Ginger, you need to know oh. this, this place reminds me. I was in a hotel in Silicon Valley okay. in Palo Alto. And it's a hotel where the Beatles stayed in the 60s. Yeah. And I think they haven't touched a thing yeah. in the hotel since that time. Like, <laughs> really? you know, it, it, very nice pool. Yeah. Uh, but that's like inside it's yeah. like falling apart, but it's, you yeah. know, and it was super expensive, but whatever. <laughs> um, here is an ash. We're in a hallway in front of the elevator. There is an ashtray. Um, and a sofa. Sofa. We can walk towards the door or towards the camera. We don't know what's there. I'm going to walk towards the camera. Oh. Hey. There's a lobby, I there's think. There's a hotel lobby. Something like this. There is like Aztec statues. Yeah. I wonder, like, it keeps coming back. Like, we played indie, right? <laughs> That's Guys, true. if you don't know, we have a great series, Indiana Jones. Fate of Atlantis, Blind Gaming, all commented, super great story. Nine hours, one of the best adventure titles ever made. Um, and, you know, Grim Fandango is legendary for its own reasons. And by the way, we're playing it because neither me, not Ginger, we've, you know, we've never played a 3D adventure before. Um, I tried some of the sources of 3D, but that was disastrous. Um, so, so you know, it's, it's new to us. But again, there's Estique. So, so let's... Whoa, whoa, whoa. So, aha. So there's more to it, actually. Um, oh. We can see the lobby, but it's actually behind us. Oh, the camera okay, is kind okay, of okay. advanced. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Ninja, you, got a, you got a new... How do you call that? Oh, uh, it's a braid. She got a new braid, braid but, but it's a tiny braid. <laughs> yeah. She just got a new braid. She didn't even tell me why. Like, that's. But and I'm so observant. Like she enters the door, I'm like, "Do you have a new bag?" And she's, "No, it's the old bag." And I'm like, "I didn't notice the braid." She doesn't tell me. Okay, I'll remember that. But I have braids all the time. I just when I'm t bored in school, so <laughs> I all braid the time. my hair. <laughs> so let's check. Um, so we're in, in the in the lobby. There number of paintings there yeah. is a sub no that's not a submarine that's um, um, a zeppelin, zeppelin yeah. and a boat like think titanic and there there is a painting on the wall and there is a statue so let's check those out not that i have a choice but i wonder if i'd be happier working on a ship and again i'm so competitive i wouldn't be able to relax until i was captain <laughs> <laughs> it's a painting of, of a ship above a city let's yeah, take right. it Okay, it's too it. big. And the statue looks like a um, Ah, monkey. the old head of the department. Way before my time, I heard he was a total slave driver. <laughs> well, All right, well, let's take yeah, the statue. Right. Okay, that was just right. So let's leave. Well, well, there's a side door and there was like a, a big door. So we're going to try locked. a small door here. Oh, it's okay. Well, we tried. No. Um, let's leave through the large door here. Can we go to the right? Yeah, that's the lobby. Well, there's another lobby, so there's yeah. there's two rooms. So there's a blackboard. Let's read it. Let's see. Where am I on this? Don Copal, Domino Hurley, Junior Sales Associates. That better not be me. <laughs> so it's it's like um, a roster of, of salespeople. Um, my seniority. I don't know who this guy is. I think he just paid for the lobby renovation. <laughs> Another statue and another painting. There she is, the number nine. One of these days, I'm going to ride her right on out of here. So number nine seems to be um, an express, yeah, a fast I think train. So. Think Hyperloop, guys. Um, by the way, I I um, I know the CEO of uh, of Hyperloop. And, it's locked. Uh, he's a fantastic cook. I swear. <laughs> His lasagna is like delicious. So, let's walk out. Oops. Okay. Wow. I'm scared to go out. We are. We've left the building. We're on the street now. We're on the street. Uh, it looks like a little bit like a bank entrance. Yeah, the building is quite big, and there are stairs leading to it, and it's quite enormous. I mean, there are two statues next to the stairs and well it's really i think the 60s or 50s because of the car that's standing right. there it's right quite, oh I, I didn't see the car yeah. because of the microphone I'm yeah sorry. it's quite an old car so it's maybe 30s even not yeah 40s. like we don't know well, sorry guys we can check the painting on the it, it's before our time for sure 
There is. I remember the year they built that. Mostly because it cost so much, we didn't get bonuses that year. <laughs> oh my! Oh, uh, so far the game is really funny. So we can either walk down the street or we can use the car. Ginger, what will it be? No, I don't know. Can we check out the car? Is so it ours? Save the game. Yeah. <laughs> I remember that someone said something about a driver waiting for us. Yeah, I mean, we can go see. I mean, uh, let's just. Hey, hey, there's a sign. No parking. Client car pickup <laughs> okay. only. Okay. All right, that's good. So that's our car. Oh, I sold so many car travel packages when I was first starting <laughs> out. When did I lose my edge? Come on, Manny. We feel for you already. Um, how do we? We use can't car? operate cars. That's how they keep us from skipping town. Oh. I left my tow truck back in my other suit. So where's the driver? The driver doesn't seem to be in the car. Oh, Let's I sold again. so many car travel packages when I was first <laughs> starting out. When did I lose my edge? Oh my god, this is great. So, let's walk down the street because we need to find the driver. It's like, come on, how are we supposed to sell anything <laughs> if we get like zero sell support? Whoa! Oh. Yeah, it's, okay. it's like... Uh, Highway, maybe. yeah, highway, but uh, uh overpass. Yeah, there is a, a sign. sign. I'm not walking on the freak. The petrified forest, Ruba Kava. Not really that far away, but to me, they might as well be on the other side of the world. I shouldn't even be standing here. So there's two interesting things <laughs> on the screen. Like first, it says petrified forest, eight kilometers. Yeah. So we're presumably in US and it's kilometers instead of miles. And the second is, you know, notice the American saying that, you know, eight kilometers is really far away for him. It's like an hour of walking, an hour, 20 minutes, something like that. Uh, Rubakawa is 1,020 kilometers. Yeah, well, it's a couple more hours then, but like, you know. So we're walking, there's just an empty road or I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't, I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't even be oh, standing right. here. Well, there's no cars going back and forth. I'm not walking on the freeway. I shouldn't even be standing here. Okay. He so we're gonna go back to um to the me. entrance and then the other way. Okay. Did it? What a nice production, really. I'm like, how how come I've never played this game before? Yeah, here? it's true. I played it all like in I, <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, not all of it. A lot of it. Oh, hey! there's a piñata. Piñata! <laughs> okay. Oh so my god, this is crazy. We are going downtown, maybe. There are many big buildings and the street is quite busy. I mean, the, there's a carnival or something like that. Yeah, there's a festival or a carnival. There's a, a purple yellow, green and red flags across the street. There's a large yellow horse piñata and, and there's also what's presumably a mouse piñata. Maybe. But we only see the head. There's birds on the roof. There is a side um, street that we're going yeah. to go into. And then there's the market. And there are many tents with souvenirs maybe. Oh, I'm so excited for this game. Let's check out <laughs> the side street if there's gonna be any fuck. And But there's no one on the street, so I mean, it's quite... It's dead. Yeah, it is. <laughs> okay, hey. the side so there, street. So there are some reliefs on the wall that look like um, Skeletons, skulls. Skeletons, skulls. I don't like the way that eye is looking at me. The eye is blue and it's quite big. Let's use it, it's gonna be Hello? a secret button. Many things it's camera. Not picking that checking? up. We can, we can probably use it, but there seems to be a secret passage. Do you hear that, guys? It's a trap door. When we yeah, there is a trap door. But I don't know how to open floor. it. And there is um, how do you call it? Like a rolled gate. It's huge. I can't open it. We can't open it. Can we go forward? There's a wall. It's uh, a dead end. Oh, but there is a rope or something All like right, that. Alright, this is crazy, guys. The, so we're in so dead. many options. But there is a rope that goes to the roof of one of the buildings, which is, you know, like the festive rope. Uh, it probably got torn. It looks like a rope, but it's really just a bunch of cheap ties tied together. Oh, it's ties. Alright, Manning, climb. 
He's going to do that, guys. Well, he can't die, you know. <laughs> he's only climbing using his hands. He, and he's got no muscles. <laughs> wow. We climbed half the roof. Oops. Wow. We're really high, guys. It gives me a little bit of hiccups. <laughs> there is even a piece Whoa. of... I don't want to fall. Missing. Oh, there's a piece of roof missing, which is right underneath a ladder. Yeah. Like, and we may need to use that ladder. But there is an office window open. And there... There is a pigeon, but it's <laughs> oh dead God. as well. It's a skeleton. It's a pigeon skeleton. <laughs> the pigeon is only a skeleton. It's oh, so like we couldn't see cute. from the... I like but it. it's so cute. Can we keep him? <laughs> it looks like a spider. Oh! He's gone. Oh, we can go around the corner. There are more of them. <laughs> Uh, so let's try. There's an open window. Yeah. Let's go in and see what it does. Come on, Manny. It's. Oh, I think it's our office. It's not our office because it's our, our office, office is red chairs, yeah, that's green true, chairs. That's true. We have um, a bronze computer. This is a blue computer with yeah. a lot yeah. of post-it yeah, notes. Yeah, you're right. You're right. So, so we're in the office. Quite a mess. Papers, files everywhere. Blue computer sitting there, which is a typewriter connected to a big round screen. A little. Um, Cyberpunk or steampunk, if you will. Um, a lot of files. There's a little green wall, meeting table full of files. Let's check all these out. It's somebody else's office. Let's kind of rummage through. Oh, it's Memo my from the desk of Don Copal. Hey, Bigger than ours. Work orders are assigned by my office and are not exchangeable among salesmen. Swapping, <laughs> selling, and specially stealing work orders will result in severe disciplinary action. Wow! Okay. What if if we found it? Is it stealing? That's true. It may be. <laughs> right, yeah. Let's uh, chase computer. There are files in the. This place is a mess. And I trash. would love to search Don's office right now, but I'm late for the poisoning. Come on, Danny. Maybe we need it to come later. It looks like Don's but... rigged his computer to automatically answer his intercom. Let's use the computer. Hey. Oh, there are many options. We can choose between not now, ever. It will have to wait. I'm in the middle of a very important meeting. Didn't I say no interruptions today? Or whatever it is, I will have to wait. Well, that's not really options. There are many. There's oh, more. Oh, wow. Our cry observer, just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy. Eva, please. I need a little time alone. Tell them the checks aren't here yet. I'm on the phone. If you buzz me again, I swear I'll jump out of this window. <laughs> so I think the only real answer that we want to have here and select here is our cripes, Eva. Just sign it yourself, yourself. William. I'm busy. So we don't need that now, but I'll we're going to switch to that. response here. Ah, cripes, because... Eva. Just sign it yourself, <laughs> will you? I'm busy. I like the voice acting. Yeah, and in the future, you know, it might come in handy. And it's we didn't That's really true. do anything. That's it's a it's not even a computer. We didn't even alter a computer. It's <laughs> it's it's like a typewriter, right? <laughs> Did you get all employees of the right? Department of Death Bureau of Acquisitions, <laughs> employees who have made their sales quarters, are invited to take the Day of the Dead as a holiday, as long <laughs> as they make the up dead. the time lost on the following weekend. Idiota! <laughs> <laughs> wow. So, Manny obviously likes to work. Here is uh, more files. This place is a mess. Um, I up. would love to search Don's office right now, ah, but I'm late for the poisoning. In the case files. Just thinking about Don's file system gives me a cold chill. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's go back. Um, you know, the game's probably scheduled to entice you to go to the market, but... It's good to know that the office is there. You know, the brutal OCD made us... <laughs> we uh, can check through the other path. windows as well. I think it's all the same windows, yeah, right? Yeah, I know. Ah, uh -huh. there's nobody in Domino's office. Well, we know we went there. <laughs> right, let's climb down. I think we'll have to come back later. By the way, there's gargoyles um, on on the walls. Really nice game so far. Like, can I play this game like all night? <laughs> Let's calm down. Here it goes. 
We're back on the street level. That was fast. And we okay. hear the festival. Let's go. Let's go there. Did you do like to dance? I can't really dance, but I like to dance. Yeah. Oh, I'm terrible <laughs> at dancing. <laughs> well, it doesn't stop me at times. At, at times, <laughs> very important clause. So we're reaching the market and the piñata. I want some candy. Oh. <laughs> Wow, finally we see we see someone not in the building. I'm so sorry, this is so... <laughs> I don't know what to say. When we see the tents, we are near the tents, we can see the flags and there is... I think it's a bakery in one of the tents. Oh, it's clear my eyes, guys. Yeah. Uh, like Glasses. Here. It's quite... <laughs> this is crazy. It's quite... There is a clown Surprise. and he's, he's a clown. <laughs> Like skeleton cloud. <laughs> He's wearing a little tiny pink hat, I mm. think. It looks like a skeleton that's trying very hard to yeah. see happy. It's true. He has. <laughs> yeah, I'm dead, but I'm full a of big joy. smile drawn on his uh, face. Let's, let's talk to him. That's let's gonna be. To him. And he's trying to like what? Produce a balloon animal? Maybe. Yeah. It looks like this. Looks like some sort of crafty mine. Oh, he's hey, a mime. What's going down, clown? Hey, back off, suit. I'm practicing. <gasps> practicing what? Or can I walk through your tent? I want to see the parade. Some festival. Uh, or I have to go. That sound makes me want to kill somebody. <laughs> right. So let's take it. Okay, let's know, just check with him. What? Ring in your neck. What does it look oh, like? Oh my, that's quite a clown. <laughs> Twist me up. Them, huh, yeah, oh, yeah, okay. yeah. Twist this, all right? It's quite scary. But you can do a cat. Well, we have a sight, so if you're scary, you <laughs> scary. Cat shows what you know, buddy. I can do anything. I can do birds, amphibians, famous poets. Go ahead. <laughs> Name one. Okay, a cat, or a dingo, or a dead worm, or Robert Frost. <laughs> I want to see you, yeah. Trying the stuff, eh? He's going for it. Ta-da! Oh. oh, he has produced a face with a pipe, but now we have that balloon, so I'm gonna put it into our inventory. It may yeah, be useful. And let's try and get him to produce more for us. Maybe. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, jeez. What now? A dead worm? A dead worm, a dingo, a cat. Maybe a, a dead, dead worm. worm. Heck, What's that? A dead geez. worm, I mean. <laughs> Is well, let's get all of them that way if we can get more. Yeah. There's no limit dead on worms. those. It's not an inflated balloon, it's an empty balloon. So we have. An empty balloon now in our inventory, My and let's go uh, for another balloon animal. Jeez, uh, what now? A, a dingo? That's my specialty. That's what we thought. Oh, wow! It looks really good. It even has little teeth, teeth right? <laughs> and now for the cat. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Jeez, uh, what now? Okay. A cat. No problem. Ta da! Okay. So we have a, a lot of balloons now, and let's talk to him some more. Can I walk through your tent? I want to see the parade. Well, walk through someone else's tent, all right? Do I look like a turnstile to you? <laughs> okay, we have more. Options like some festival, eh, or could you teach me how to do that? Teach me how to do that. Well, uh, since you're a beginner, why don't you practice the first step, <laughs> which is blow? Oh, okay. <laughs> Pop another one. Lousy bony fingers. <laughs> Sorry. Some festival, huh? Yeah. Yeah, pretty busy. My carpal tunnel syndrome's really acting up. Oh, you don't have any they are also positive. Fingers. Yeah, well, you don't have a tongue, but that doesn't seem to shut you up now, does it? 
This game's crazy. Oh. I have to go. That sound makes me want to kill somebody. You too? <laughs> right, so how can we. Oh, get there was something the in a bakery, I think. Yeah, there's a. There's a. But bucket? Sorry. Yeah, but I think you can take something. Those crates are completely blocking the sidewalk. What if I'll they were a fire? Oh. oh, what if they were a fire? So we have to set the crates fire. Uh, by the way, how the crates be a fire? <laughs> Bread of the dead. <laughs> oh my! Now uh, let's take some bread. Since I really didn't get to celebrate the festival this year, I think I'm entitled to a little pan de muertos. Let's see if we can take another. I'll just take a little more bread to honor the dead. Seriously, how much can we take? <laughs> and it's it's I'll large. I'll just take right, a right? little more bread to honor the dead. <laughs> yeah, well. Our, our inventory is probably not living. I'm gonna try again. I just take a little more bread to honor the dead. Oh my god! So is these situations in games where I'm kind of like, how many should I take? Yeah, Do I just, take more? Yeah, just, I take three, then I run into puzzle I that will require five, right? Oh my god, ginger, ginger! What else can we do here? We need to set the crates on fire, but we don't have any way to we do that. Have right? any, yeah. So let's see, can we use them? They're just full of party favors, and I'm not in the party mood. I don't need to hurt you. Right. Mm -hmm. Money, you can't get hernia if you don't have muscles. But. So let's walk away. That's not. It's not so much fun. Okay, so we can't. No, 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 no! Come on, Manny. What are you doing? Don't, don't walk away. He's walking away. It's back on the highway. Which doesn't seem to be possible at all. Let's see, maybe the driver got back, which I don't believe. Oh, Ginger! You can oh. press shift so that we run. Oh. Maybe I can double click. Oh, I sold so many car travel packages when hmm. I was first starting out. Didn't we did check I lose everything in the building? We can't operate cars. That's how they keep us from skipping town. So, you know what, let me try the festival again and we'll go to the building. I think that... So there's either something with the eye, with the skeleton with the eye. Yeah. Because I think we need Starfire here, um, the game tells us so. So, it's either something in the building, or it's that side street. So I'm thinking maybe there's a conversation we can have with okay, Eva so to sign something for us. That's true, maybe. So, maybe let's try the fish. We are here, so... And uh, let's yeah, see what's fish, in our inventory, it's, right? It's your specialty. Yeah, fish on a <laughs> stick, right? Again, guys, if you don't get the reference in Indiana Jones. So we have four party balloons. <laughs> oh my, we have... A dead worm. A dead worm. Actually, I thought it was a balloon, but it <laughs> looks like a dead worm. It really is. We have the cats. Dead bread. Bread, a lot of bread. Oh my god, like three, four loaves of bread. Sites, right? So, I'm really thinking. Hmm. Um, can we use the bread to traverse to the other area? What can we do with with a fish eye? Or I don't like the is? way that eye is looking at me. Hmm. Well, we probably can't use bread with it, right? <laughs> to touch it. Well, if he wanted, he would touch it. No, let's try for a balloon. Got you. The well, bread of we... the dead. <laughs> we can examine. I'm gonna use the crumbs bread. all over. <laughs> that wouldn't be a very good use of this special ceremonial bread. All right. So my idea was probably not that great. So let's go back to the office. Okay, let's try. I'm thinking if there's anything that we might have missed. So it didn't take us long to that kind of be a not very get good stuck, use of but this special um, ceremonial no, just bread. open the door. That wouldn't be a very good use of. I'll just put it into your inventory and open the door. So it's not like we're stuck. We're just not exactly sure what to do next. So there's it's a locked door. The statues. We explore them. Yeah. 
The other door is locked again. It's locked. It's locked as well. Um. We have to take that out, I think. Can we use the board? Let's see. Where am I on this? Don Copal, hmm. Domino Hurley, Junior Sales Associates. That <laughs> better not be me. Right, so this doesn't seem to be anywhere, so let's talk to Eva a little bit more. Maybe even if we just tell her that Don is not there. Oh, sorry. Wrong way. This way, use the elevator. Ping. Hey, Eva, we're back. Did you miss us? Oh. Um, are you kidding me? There's another there's elevator. There's another elevator. How come we didn't see that one? Oh, there's a garage. Oh, here's our driver. We're in a garage. Oh. That's stupid. Okay, but we got a bread. <laughs> yeah, we, said we have bread at least. So we're in a garage that seems to have cars hanging the way you see meat hanging in a but butchery. Yeah. Am I blind? Or is no, it happening? is. It's it, it really a really large empty hall That's garage. Weird. There was a black car that passed through and got out of the garage. There is a parking meter. There's a parking meter. Don't tell me we'll have to pay. No. With bread. <laughs> there are lights for wash, rinse, mm. wax, no, and land it. of the living, depending on your destination. A okay. The Can driver demons it? operate this somehow, and the company won't tell a salesman how it works. Gotta keep us down somehow. Okay, it looks like people from this land are traveling through here to get to us. Right, let's find some driver demons. Driver demon. That sounds scary. <laughs> it's oh, we oh can see God. the cars hang. It's conveyor belt. Yeah, uh, sort of. Oh. So there is. Hey, do you see what I see, Ginger? Um, there's a couple of things, but there's like a little small cottage, co like um, like a booth, like a yeah. room. Well, it looks like a toilet, maybe. Because oh, that is mad on it. Who's afraid of a little rusty water? <laughs> Let's use this water. Hey, oh. Who's better with my stuff? Oh, oh my, my god. god! A big blue demon. Oh, sorry, I'm orange sorry, demon. Sir. Sir. I didn't expect sales agents usually don't come over to this part of the garage. <laughs> He's like okay. twice as big as as men. the cabin in which he was. Right. Yeah. yeah, well, that's also right. I didn't <laughs> notice, Ginger, but you're right. He's, yeah, I, I could see how he, he was literally stuck in the. Right, right. We can uh, give him a compliment about the. Oh my god, <laughs> you don't want to see the options. <laughs> we have, hey, are you a driver? Oh, I'm Calavera, Manny Calavera. Oh, nice heart. All right, back in the shack, Mac. <laughs> he's really big. I mean, what? he's. Three times the biggest. It's probably right. So yeah. is he a driver? driver? Me? Ha! No, 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 no! I don't ride him. Just wrench him. But he's not a skeleton, you know. He's, he's a demon. Yeah, he's a demon. <laughs> that's true. He doesn't look scary to me. It's funny. We should have the option to ask him. I'm right? Calavera. <laughs> Manny Calavera. My name's Gladys. I don't get many visitors. Hey, I got a message for a Mr. Calavera. Uh, okay. the driver said that Mr. Hurley said that he could have the rest of the day off. Domino sent my driver home? Yeah, oh. wasn't that nice? Uh oh. Oh, looks like I need a new driver. Oh, Glottis is that a German name? Oh, let's say that for later. Yeah, yeah. Looks yeah, like I need true. a new driver. Oh, I, uh, I, uh, I would agree with that. <laughs> yes, Thank you, you do. You can't fit in a car. You want to be my replacement driver? You want to be my replacement driver? <laughs> Me? Oh, oh no. Sorry, can't. Damn. Why? Come on, Gladys. I need you to be my driver. Come on, Gladys. I need you to be my driver. No, I can't. I'm. I'm too fat I'm to fit in a car. Too big. <laughs> too big. That's too what big. you want to say. You're, you're right. not too big. You're just you're right. Big. You're oh, just sorry. Right. That's okay. all they options. told me no, they again were great. and again. I'm too big to drive. Oh my poor little. Look at this. You're not too big. You just have a self-image problem. <laughs> or you're not too big. The cars are just too small. That's it. And screw the rules. Come with <laughs> Come me. With so me. let's go you're one by one. Too big. 
You just have a self-image problem. A what? <laughs> Repeat after me. I am not fat. I am thin. Women find me attractive. Hey, I never said I was too fat for the ladies. Just the cars. The ladies <laughs> like me just fine. <laughs> what do you want laughter? You're not too big. The cars are just too small. Yeah, those dang compact cars. Hey, that gives me an idea. Oh I could Here alter your car just a bit with just a quick torch job to let out the seams, you know? <laughs> I'm, I'm not allowed to modify the cars without a work order from upstairs. I could okay. lose my job. No work a work order, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't torch anything bigger than a cigarette without one of these signed yeah. by the right, boss himself. I, I, I can hey, see. Here we go. That's okay. my line. Getting people to sign. Back in a snap. Yeah, too small. I'm not too big. No, Everything you're around gigantic. Here is just too small. <laughs> oh, oh my god. He got back into the cabin. So the kind of squeezy noise you heard, guys, it's when his bottom is trying to squeeze through the door. It's really horrible. But uh, it's it's you know. not horrible. I mean, you know, it's interesting. It's fun. That won't you help know. it get signed. It's really good that we've checked the Eva right. Ocean. Right. <laughs> hey, Manny, did you get that work order signed yet? No. Can we just do it without? I told you I could lose my job, Manny. If I lose my <laughs> job. Hey, 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 don't worry. Oh, just go on back to work. I like him. This game's I'll crazy. I'll get that work order signed somehow. Where was it when I was in high school? It was like, <laughs> so let's save here just in case our video screws up or anything. Save game slot one. Yes. yes. And let's go upstairs because we know how to get that work yeah, order signed. Yeah, I think so. Or we think we know. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da The music is amazing. <laughs> Whoa, I love the atmosphere. It really creates the atmosphere with the music. I mean. Okay, what Eva. is that horrible squeaking noise you're making? <laughs> New shoes. <laughs> it's in the balloons. Does she like the balloons? I don't know. Let's talk to her. Eva, I really need the boss to sign this work order. You know, Kapal's not really in his office. Or again, just one more question about my job or well, I gotta hope. So what do we do here? That's quite hard. Kapal's not really in his office. Uh, I really need the boss to sign this work order. I really need the boss. It implies maybe that we are proper and you want to do things properly, maybe. Alright, so number one. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I really need the boss to sign this work order. I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, Mr. Calavera has something out here that he says he needs your signature on. Ah, oh, cripe saver, just sign it yourself, <laughs> will you? I'm busy! Oh, good. Here we go, yeah, she's signing. Excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crossword puzzle he's got in there today. <laughs> <laughs> hey, That's so ironic. Rest. I had no idea you had this kind of power. Well, we all have our secrets. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> so, so just by the way, hey, her lighter is not working. No, well, Manny's Manny helping her, which means. <laughs> okay, I think that now we see the. Now we have the lighter, right? Yeah. So Manny's got the Undertaker outfit. You know the Reaper outfit. Glottis <laughs> is trying to fit in the, fit in the car. Hey, I look good in this, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well. They say black is slimming. Oh, right. The car is black. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. I mean, like, two thirds of his body is out of the car. Everything but the, the hands and the car and the legs. He's in the car. He's crazy. He's running really fast. I could have walked faster than this. Ugh, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna miss the poisoning. <laughs> He's driving just like a like baby would be. Okay. Hey. We've arrived somewhere. Uh, quite a it's bit a there. City. A lot of dead people. Domino. 
Oh, so we're seeing other cells, guys? The living still give me the creeps. What? Wow, where are we? I mean, it's really weird. <laughs> what? <laughs> the graphics is really weird. It's visually a little distressing. It's like a collage. Yeah, so what I think that we're seeing is like a collage of people being stuck in time. Yeah. And some of their yeah. facial parts are enlarged or distorted because it's like yeah. a collage, so they don't really fit. Um, it all is like a collage cut out photograph, basically. There is some burger and fries on the table. Mm -hmm. And there is a guy in a resic bag who is probably, I don't know, dead sure. or alive. We don't really know. But it seems like we got a client here. As, as we were approaching here, we saw the other sales guys already going in cars with their clients. So we better hope this one is richer. Do we want to talk to him straight or do we want to explore first? I don't know. Maybe there is something we can take with us. I'm not sure. So. Yeah, like the french fries, right? Maybe. The poison ones. <laughs> I have to say, this food looks pretty good. <laughs> Only everybody just died. World, all I can do is look, okay. smell and reap. Okay, so aha, uh -huh, we probably like entered the world of the living, mm. which is why everybody is collaged because they're like stuck in time. Let's look at them. Look at these poor saps. Can we talk to her? It's the fear of death <laughs> that makes monsters of us all. <laughs> what? I'm not sure. Seriously, Manny? Smiles as bright and wide <laughs> as the blade on my scythe. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, she made a face. Scaring the living is technically against the rules, but we all do it. Ah. Soon I'll be coming for them. <laughs> oh my god. If I scare them to death, then they'll become a customer. But I'll get nailed with a conflict of interest rap. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Alright, let's talk. Oh, okay. oh, there's a can. There's a can. Truth be told, I'd rather be setting this milkshake soul free. So let's do it. Mm, smells like the per rich and sweet. <laughs> Can't reap the milkshake. Can only smell it. Oh, sorry, I clicked okay. there. He yeah. said. Mm, smells like the perfect client. Rich and sweet. So we can check out the one in the the dead guy. Yeah. Bound Bag. only by the paper thin wrapper of mortality, mm. a soul here lies, struggling to be free. And so it shall, mm. thanks to a bowl of bad gazpacho <laughs> and a man named Calavera. <laughs> All right. Oh my, really? Would someone die of food poisoning in the middle of a restaurant? I'm not sure. I don't want to know. <laughs> my bare hands. I'm a professional. Oh. Oh, we need to use a side. But I'm not coming to a restaurant again. Hey, we didn't even have to select the side from the menu. It just mm. uh, unrolled. And it's a little, it's like compact. Mm. Yeah. Like you can fold yeah, it. Yeah, Very practical. Yeah, you can <laughs> fold it or unfold it. <laughs> so let's cut here. Okay, we've ripped the bag and there's a skeleton sitting Surprisingly. inside. Surprisingly. Nice bathroom. <laughs> wow. We got a client. We're coming back to the garage with Glotis. But we offer several travel package upgrades if you care to cut the yeah. I want something cheap where I can get some rest and that's it. Ay ay ay. You know man, I could me. make this car a little faster if you wanted. Yeah yeah, whatever. Oh yeah, slam the front into the weeds, tub the rear end, do blowers, <laughs> pop the hood. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. He's really mad. You'll get plenty of rest this way, Mr. Martinez, and you'll be safely padded by the foam created when these two chemicals mix like this. Oh, on second thought, I want to upgrade my package. Sorry, Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary mug. No, wait! <laughs> Today's the first day of your life. Can where I can move my legs? You know I'd like to, Bruno, but my boss is a real hard ass. I gotta there be honest goes. when I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. I got a sale right here. I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. 
How am I supposed to make premium sales with the scumbag clients you're sending me? Hey! Now you're blaming the clients? I've had it with you, Manny. If you haven't bagged a premium before the next sales report comes in, you're out! Out on the street! No job! No way to work off your time! Just your fancy suit and your big smile and a whole lot of time to kill! Who oh, you call oh. a scumbag? Why well, I ought to... He's pouring a uh, liquid material all over him. In Just fall in the game. Yep. Show Sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick. It's time to take one. Right. <clears throat> so here we are back in the hallway uh, in front of Eva's reception. There's a couple of things that happened. We got this client who was real little angry. Um, and we found him into a cheap coffin because he didn't have any upgrade, um, you know, any any room for upgrade, as we say, he didn't have the money. But now Manny said it's time to take a lead in capitals. So that refers back to when, you know, we walked to yeah. other people's office, he probably wants to steal that. The other thing is that the previous cutscene, before he left uh, for the restaurant, he was using a lighter to light up Eva's cigarette. Yeah, that's true. So maybe that lighter is in our inventory so we can like proceed can, in the festival. Yeah. Let's just check. And of course, I'm gonna save here very, very soon. We've got bread, bread, uh, sights, cards, ace, marked ace, balloon, dead worm, balloon, balloon, bread. Okay, mm. no lighter. Save the game. All right. And. So now we want. Hey, Domino's office is open now. I don't know if it was Domino or whoever it was. Let's walk in there. It was no, Don. It, Don. It, it, yeah. Was so Don <laughs> is uh, boxing a punch bag. Yeah, he's wearing a shirt or t-shirt, maybe. Yeah, yeah he's it's sweaty. Sweaty. Yeah, how can you get sweaty if you're a skeleton? I don't know. How can you get sweaty when you are a skeleton? The room is blue. There are three or four pictures hanging on the wall next to the door and there is a chair and we can see it much, I think. By the way, uh, Don's got a tooth protection. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what an asshole. Because that would be really a pity if your tooth right, fell right, off right, on right. your dad. Because your dad like, yeah. that sucks. Let's uh, it's look Domino at him. Early. The sweatiest man in the office. Ooh. You gotta sweat the cell, Callie, and you know it. Can we well, talk to him? Talk to him, well, sure. Well, at least you're not hitting the bottle anymore. Hey, Callie, how you doing? So, how would you make out at the poisoning? I want to ask you a question. I want to tell you something, or I want just wanted to stop by and touch base. See ya. Let's take it um, one by one. Maybe. Sure. Well, how'd you yeah. make out of the poisoning? Well, let's just say that Sister Calabaza has a secret passion. Oh, he's turned to For us. trains. You got a nun? Hail Mary. And you sold her a ticket on the number nine train. Choo-choo, little buddy. Oh. Say, what? how'd you score? I got a nun too. I got two nuns actually. I got a mean midget. I had to send a parcel post on <laughs> none of your business, Hurley. Well, I'm not sure. Do we want to boast? <laughs> yeah, let's boast. I got two okay. nuns actually. Hey, that reminds me of this really funny joke. Hurley. Oh, he's not listening to us. <laughs> I want to ask you a question. I want to tell you something. Oh, I want to punch you in the mouth. That was really quick. I mean, <laughs> that was no joke, right? Uh, I want to punch you in the mouth, it's probably not nice. Yeah. Let's ask you a question. I want to ask you a question. Shoot, slugger. Is it hard to kiss up to the boss <laughs> so much with no lips? Oh, can I have one of your clients? Why do you get all the good clients? On second thought, I bet I can figure it out on my own. Well, I think all the questions are quite interesting. The first one maybe is a little insulting. Let's let's just beg for the client yeah. first. We can insult okay. him if he doesn't yeah, ask. Can I have one of your clients? <laughs> sure, Cal. Just as soon as really? I get one I think you could handle, I can handle anything you got. Especially if that's your best right jab. Right. Okay. 
What did you do to get this job? What did you do to get this job? You mean, what's my secret to success? No, exactly. I mean, how did you screw up and get stuck here at the BOD? <laughs> what sin did you commit and how long are you going to have to work here to pay it off? Well, I could easily ask the same question of you, but I don't know the answer. I would answer. like to know. I still don't know what I've done. Well, how convenient. Then uh, what? neither do mm. I. What do you mean, wow. Manny? Why do you get all the good clients? You're asking the wrong guy. You should be taking a good long look at the man in the mirror. No thanks. <laughs> I don't enjoy that the same way you do. Oh my god, all the dead cells, man. Oh yeah, that's Is not, it hard that to kiss happen. up to the boss so much when you got no lips? <laughs> hey, I got all the lip I need. I get it from <laughs> oh. you. Oh boy. I wanna punch you in the mouth. I wanna punch you in the mouth. <laughs> oh no, not the Christmas party all over again. <laughs> What happened what at the Christmas, at the party? Christmas party? Blacked out on the whole thing, huh? Maybe you should switch to lemonade, kid. <laughs> How can a dead man get drunk? I just can't. I want to tell you something. Good. Go on and let it all out, Manny. There's no reason for you to be afraid of me. <laughs> That's true. We've already punched him, right? You know, this used to be my office. Really? I, oh my god. I think you're up to something. I think we should team up, be partners. Oh, let's go one by one. Yeah. You know, this used to be my office. Yeah, I know. I found your name on some comic books in the desk. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. I want my office back. I want that sums back. up my sales career as well, by the way. I want my office back. Don't worry, you'll have years and years to enjoy it after I get promoted out and you're still here. I think you're up to I think you're up to something. <laughs> yeah, I'm up to about four premium sales oh. this week. <laughs> oh, we need to get one. I think we should team up, be partners. Oh, Manny, I, I would, but I'm too intimidated. I could never be partners with someone who was so much more of a man than me. Oh, come on. I've seen your wife. Well, you sound pretty out of breath, so I'm gonna blow. Always a pleasure, Cal. Hmm. So some interesting dialogue. Ginger. That's true. We've learned a lot of new information. So Manny doesn't know why he's stuck uh, in this world, um, but uh, you know, he he used to be in a better position in yeah. the department before. I think Dom so, would call the company shrink if I left through the window. <laughs> <laughs> We've tried to go through the window. So but... there is a picture on the roof. Which is not exactly the Sistine Chapel, but it's yeah. like a, a, a pigeon and a lady. Maybe. They're both skeletons, of course. Yeah, and the lady has long, maybe blonde hair, curly. Is there any horror that has a lady and a pigeon? A pigeon, I'm not sure. I don't think so. <laughs> and there's a bottle. Let's try the bottle. That's some premium looking scotch. Have some, Manny. Just so you don't forget what premium tastes like. Oh, come on, I want to punch him. Yeah, that's true. He tells us to drink when he already had the, you know. We just took a sip. Okay. But I wanted to. <laughs> you you want to get drunk? No, I want to. I want to take the whole bottle, like, for later. I, I just don't want to sip. But let's keep sipping then. <laughs> we get drunk. Probably not. <laughs> And we get so drunk that we punch him. And what if you choose Ch the other option, you know? Not just, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no difference. Yeah. But a uh, great question. Here is his. Maybe he's. No messages in Dom's fancy red too. Uh, mm. Let's use his computer. Hey, Dom. What's your screensaver password? Get away from my computer, Manny. Come on, hey, Dom. Use it anyway. What's your screensaver password? Get away from my computer, Manny. Hey, get out of there, Calavera. Oh. Right, so he's in the office. We can probably use something with the bottle. So that when he drinks, he, you know, mm. has some issue and uh, and he vacates the office. So probably not bread, but I'm thinking what if we slip that worm? Oh! Into his, uh, you know. Oh wow! I well, don't that say wow it. because uh, that's not what balloons idea. are for. It is oh. a stupid idea, but I, I tried. I Never tried. mind. I think it's a good idea. So maybe we need to go to the boss's office again. Yeah, and check out what's there. Yeah, and just grab a file there. 
Because before he didn't want to search the yeah, files, he said, because, you know, yeah, all he the poisoning. Had no time. So I'm sorry, OCD, I have to save the game. It's okay. Better to be saved than sorry, I think. Yeah, I'm always safe and sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, what balloons are for. Our first hour in Ginger and, uh, you know, it's smooth and flying yeah. and the game feels really good. You know, really oh, cool. wow. Uh, you and your Red fancy demon. suits and your nose holes way up A in the air, demon. sticking your empty beer in bottles the down the message tubes. How fancy is that? Huh? Psycho Don't you swine. boys upstairs realize the tube switcher is a sophisticated oh. and delicate piece of machinery? Huh? You think you're better than me? No. Good. A big red monster. So here's what I think. There's something wrong with the pipes and there is a stuck message. So uh -huh. let us go after him because we want oh. that message. We've got into a new room. There is a big machine in the middle of the room. There's nothing, just the machine. And I think it's wrong. Maybe uh, there's something wrong with it. There is something in the middle that's rotating around, I think. Is the there are the message tubes all around. Yes, yeah, so here, see, here's the deal, Ginger. That's what I see. Is there's there's a room with message with large iron door. Mm. There's fans pulling off like the system, and and the message is like it seems like the machine like either can't fit the message into a pipe or doesn't know which it's one to stuck. fit the pipe in. Yeah. And the pipes have colors like not all of them, but there's one which is red. Red. And we know that red goes to Domino's. Domino's room. Right? room. Um, so let's see if we can get closer to it. That red tube looks familiar. Yeah. We know. So let's open the door. Can we do that? That wheel should open it. So um, before we do that, what I see here is a fire extinguisher. That's true. Can we take it? Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. Oh. Well, it may come in handy even later as a fair. Yeah, the at the fair, but also I'm thinking it's about the size of the message, right? Yeah. Like I'm not yeah, it's good. Let's open the door. Oh. The won't turn and the door won't budge. Oh no. Oh, come on. That wheel open it. <clears throat> Do we have anything to turn the wheel? The wheel won't turn and the door won't budge. What do we have in our inventory again? Balloons. So this is probably not gonna help, right? Hmm. The fire extinguisher. How's it gonna open Size. the door? Mm. We're, we're, we can try to use the side but No, okay, that was... <laughs> no. So we probably need more items. Hmm. Hmm. So let's go back to the boss's room. Did I save? I did, right? You did. All right, OCD. <laughs> did I close the door? I know. I'm the same, so I know. Oh my god, here we go. Let's climb up. The piano is so beautiful, guys. I really like festivals, I mean. Um, I was in Japan, they had this festival of fertility. It's a little crazy, mm. you don't want to know, like, <laughs> what they're carrying I think around. I can imagine. Oh, <laughs> luckily I can't, I mean, like, <laughs> hey, we're climbing up the roof, let's go to the boss's office. Come on, Manny! This guy is so lovable. Right? Mm. Whoa, here's a problem. The window is yeah. now closed. It's locked. Oh no. It's locked. Seriously? Maybe he has returned. We can look through the blue one. Maybe we can talk to Eva then and get to him somehow. No, Domino's in there. Oh. Alright, so. Right. That's bad. We go back or we just smash the window with a fire extinguisher. Can we do that? <laughs> I'm not sure. Well. The window is in there. While we're here, why don't we just. Uh, try, you know. That's true. Or just put a balloon on the window. So you here's need to the distract him. Yeah, here's the thing. Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. And we're gonna use it with That's not on fire. Nothing. Mm, it's not gonna work. So we're going back down, guys. That's not so on I, fire. How do I put it back? So he's in the office now. And the um, rope of ties is what he uses to get away That's from true. his boss, right? So, uh, we know that. But do you want to talk to Eva? Or 
look at the festival. Maybe like, there's know. something changed at the festival. I'm not sure. Let's just stop. Uh, we are here, so what? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh, no, nothing's okay. changed. Everything's balloons. What, like, what do we do with balloons? So, so there's more places we can go. We can go talk to Eva. Yeah. But there's also the Glottis guy we can talk to. Glottis. Yeah, that's true. We and can. perhaps we can find the other demon as well. Yeah, maybe. So let's do all that. Talk to Eva. Maybe we can talk to the boss. Like, give us a case. So let's try the boss first. It's the same room. Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. Oh, come on, He Eva. never wants to be disturbed. He never does anything. You know, Kapal's not really in his office. You know, Kapal's oh, hey, not you know, really in his was... office. Sweetheart, I know what you're up to. Huh? You're trying to get me away from my desk so you can link all my paper clips together again. <laughs> Grow up, darling. <laughs> oh. <laughs> all right. Hey, Mr. Great Poisoning. Hey, Mr. Great Poisoning. Yeah, and you missed a great client. Domino came back from there with a nun. Equally, I got a tiny little man with a mean temper and no commission. Well, at least you don't work for one. Hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> I can't find my driver. Manny, you know what to do. Stop playing dumb just to flirt with me. So, you're going to a Christmas so, you're going party? going to a Christmas party? <laughs> After the spectacle you made of yourself last year, I wouldn't miss it for the world. Maybe we can learn a little bit more about that. Any good gossip? Well, I heard Domino got a raise. Por favor, tell me some good news, why don't you? <laughs> I still love you. You're all I really Whoa. need, Bayesa. Hmm. Where is everybody? Oh, Manny, did you forget what day it is today? Oh, man, did I come in on Saturday again? <laughs> it's the Day of the Dead. Everybody's back in the land of the living, visiting their families like we should be. What? Wow, why aren't you visiting your family why today? Why aren't you visiting your family today? Ah, the boss is here, so I gotta be here. How about you, Cal? No one back there I wanna see. And you don't want Domino here alone, getting all the good leads. That too. Okay. Busy as ever, I see. I'd have more work to do if you had more clients. Ouch. Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot of filing here to do. Right, I do watch you. Hmm. Our office check. Maybe we got mail. Probably not, though. So, there's no email for us. There is no files we want to go through, probably. Mm -hmm. So, Gladys, it is. Can we use a uh, cards with? Can we use cards with um, Domino? I've already Walker got here. one card out, and I'm not dealing more until there's money on the hmm. table. Right, there's no. Hey, I can use cards. Cards with just wouldn't help there. Nothing would help there, I think. That's tragic. So we're going uh the garage, right? Yeah. There's like a... It's a tool cabinet. Hmm. Can we take something? It's locked. Okay. Not picking that up. How could we unlock it? Isn't there a key somewhere? No, I wish. Let's uh, talk to Gladys, right? Yeah. That's why we are here. But I wonder what the other guy is, the yeah. big guy. No one in there. Oh. It's locked. This sign oh, says... Oh, come on. I'm at the junkyard. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the junkyard? Did we check the cabinet? Yeah, it's locked. Yeah. It's locked. Hmm. Damn. Can we use sides to unlock? Probably not. <laughs> All the balloons. All the bread. <laughs> Locked. Hmm. I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade. 
No good news here. Running around the side. Well, now we know that he's gone as well. What if we just go through the exit here? To I don't want to mess up my blade. So hide your blade. Through there lies the Limbo Highway. And on the others can't go through on foot. People have tried, but they never came back. <laughs> <laughs> From the land of living. Hey, here's another door we can go it's through. Locked. Garage door. Oh, it's locked. It's locked. Damn. Well. Hey, it leads to the junkyard. I hope we're not missing any more door. Uh, let me double check. Yeah, the camera system is quite complicated. <laughs> <laughs> it's all complicated, that's right. So, what were the other options? We maybe the message room. Uh, yeah, have we checked all the lobbies to find the other monster? Well, let's uh, keep looking. Because we only went to the machine room, I think. I'm not sure. So one is the machine room, and the other one is. We haven't been there. So let's try to get there. Is this side? Yes. yes. Oh, it's where you pack the people. Oh, All right. Okay. So here's the here are some coffins, a big room with tables, coffins, and the foam pistons, and like foam tanks. So let's check the coffins. For those who enjoy no hassle travel, <laughs> Bruno, you in one of these? Must have picked them up already. Right. Mm. The foam? One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. One of the chemicals for our packing material comes out of there. Can we use them? Oh. Okay, so we, we can put some foam on the table. Chemical puddle. Can no thanks. Up? That stuff smells terrible, man. Hmm. Can we combine it? Hey! Oh, uh, there's a foam! Smell. It's a lump of our packing foam. So we're gonna no pick thanks. that up. That stuff smells terrible, man. Oh, come on, Manny. We haven't got anything we can put it into, do we? The fire extinguisher doesn't help the smell. Yeah, that's true. The sights, the pack of cards. So let's produce some more. <laughs> he threw it on the table. Put it on the table. Maybe in the other order, like red first and then blue. Like, why do you mind that it smells? You're a skeleton. Yeah, that's true. No, I don't think the. I'm gonna use red twice. Hmm. That doesn't do. No. It yeah, doesn't do anything. Okay, so it always creates a foam, no matter what order you choose. Mm, yeah. I don't want him to Damn. push it off. Can we use, like, we can probably use the film with something. I'm gonna try and use it with the bread, it's probably not going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> uh, just well, now much. that we have fire extinguisher, we can put things on fire, but we don't have any way to put things on fire. Mm. Let's hope we'd have that lighter. Dead worm? Can we, can we use it you as a bag? Feel it, you know, maybe. That's not what balloons are for. What are the balloons for? Come on, Manny! This is what I'm gonna do. I'm a genius. Oh, wow! You really are a genius! So... So we have the blue one in a balloon, but we don't oh, have the red wow. one. Wow! Which one is it? This, this balloon is one. filled with a light chemical. So, I have bad news in here. You know what was the bad news? Oh. We need more empty balloons. Okay! Well, that's what you say, it's a long way. Well, maybe we can um, yes, combine it in the balloon, you know, just take out the balloon with the light chemical and maybe. pour some more. Well, let's, well, let's know, try it. It doesn't yeah, hurt to get true. more empty balloons from this clown here. You're such a clown. My kid wants another My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Right. My Jeez, next train to be got a microphone anyway. I'm trying to avoid. 
Uh, yeah. Dead worms back there. Well, sure. Dead right. worm is quite easy for him, so. Keep them coming. This green one. Let's get some more. Just in case. You never know. The kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Ah, jeez. What now? <laughs> he Do must hate. Dead worms back the there. Well, <laughs> sure. <laughs> So I don't know how many we need, just like in my mind, the anxiety in millions. In. Yeah, and, and well it's not that in millions, is that in my mind it it's just like we need to combine the red and blue in the right way. Do you have any more dead worms back there? Well sure. It's in, I wouldn't say that's really anxiety, I'd say that's experience with gaming. <laughs> Anxious experience. <laughs> yeah, I know about this. So, anxious experience with gaming. I remember we used to play games and we like didn't save. Oh, I need save. <laughs> we didn't need save all the time, right? That's my Daddy. kid. Yeah, hey, he's gonna come into the room. Um. So, here's where we wanted to go. This one. Uh. Yeah. yeah that's the one. And now we're gonna use the red one. The right one. I don't got the lungs Let's for it. I know. It. Well, you don't have any lungs, so technically. <laughs> well, that's right. Okay. So. Well, yeah. So this is this the one. This filled with a light chemical. Can we select it and... This balloon is filled with a dark chemical. I mean, select and... I don't yeah. really want to do that. Okay. No. He doesn't want to like combine them okay. in the balloon. Okay, okay. Now, so we've got two balloons, dark and light chemicals. So what they could pop potentially do like... Fire. <laughs> no, so no, fire no, is one really. option I'm thinking of. Uh, I don't know if they could help us. So we're trying to get to the message. So I'm thinking maybe if we use the pipe post. Yeah, maybe. Then we like destroy totally. But maybe I'm completely wrong. We can try. We can try. Go to our office. <laughs> oh, the atmosphere of this game. Play it again, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we're gonna try and take Oh, which one first? The dark balloon first. So I can Let's try. Yes, he's putting it in to eh. I told you I was a genius. Look out below. Wow. Wow, now we see the machine. It does something. Oh, yep. it splashed there. Oh, I think that now we have to use the other one. Yes. Now my anxiety says we use the incorrect order, but... <laughs> oh, I don't think you can use it incorrectly. Wow. We'll see soon. The it bone looks doesn't like go in. Now it travels. Well, let's not get too graphic, right? Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, and now the foam has blocked. That doesn't sound good. Oh. Oh, okay. So now... Probably need to go there. I think so. I would go and check it out. Can we send anything more in there, like the fire extinguisher? Mm, we can probably try, not, but let's try. But... I think I already tried. No. Or a piece of bread. Sorry, just. You can try that. You know, it has the same shape as the balloon. Though. There's no yeah. air pressure. The server must be down. All right, okay, so, that's okay, so it. we can't send so, anything. Can't send anything. Server must be done, right? That was funny. Well, technically, he's right. Technically, <laughs> it is a server because it's serving pipes, but. Ba -da -ba, we made Server's some progress here. Again. What else is new? <laughs> Which way? This way. Now we're gonna meet the big red guy again. Here we go. No, 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 no. The to the way. other one, yeah. So we are returning to the machine. 
Oh, he's, he's fixing there. it. It's open. He's fixing it. Quickly, let's go. <clears throat> I look at him. Ah, a cheerful communications maintenance staff is on the job. <laughs> Hi, let's talk to I'm him. not getting any messages. Is the server down? This is their idea of a joke? <laughs> they think it's funny? I'd like to jam their tubes with packing material. See how they like that. <laughs> So you're saying the server is down, is that it? <laughs> Can I squeeze in there just for a sec? Or would you do a terrible thing like this? <laughs> yeah. Who would do a terrible thing like this? It's those punks in the mailroom. They think this baby is going to put them out of a job. And they're right. Just curious how to get in there. Well, because it's quite big and the machine room is quite small. Just right. How'd you get in there? I squeezed down one of these tubes like a pixie. How do you think I got in here? Okay. Through the door, just like you. <laughs> uh, can I squeeze in there just for can a second? I, I think they want a message. A Are you kidding? This is a highly secured oh. area. No one's allowed in here who ain't me. What's so special, What's so special about, about you? you? <laughs> I, sir, am an elemental spirit. Summoned from the land of the dead itself. Yeah, yeah, let me guess. You were given one purpose, one skill, one desire. Fixing pneumatic tube switchers. No, I was created to run the elevators, but they put in those dang motion detectors and put <laughs> me out of work. <laughs> All right. Oh, so, so the server is down. So you're it? saying the server is down, is that it? The server is not down. It's never down. It's just temporarily unavailable while I'm doing some maintenance, that's all. So how long is it going to be so down? So how long is it going to be down? With a job like this, you can never tell. Probably hours. Or until no one's around to see you sneak out, eh? Whichever comes first. <laughs> you know, I really think it's clean you know, enough. I really think I... it's clean enough. Oh, it's clean enough to run all right. I'm just fiddling around to be safe. You know, gotta cover my ass. Yes, you do. Say, uh, chatty Cathy, I got a lot of tubes to flush here. Hey, me too. I'll let you go. Hmm, so now we're seeing a different angle. I don't know why. The guy's scratching his ass. Oh, we... Not again! Fire! Fire! Oh, we got him fire! We got the fire extinguisher. You tried Man is pulling it out. Sky high? That's a magnesium compound fire extinguisher! Spray that on this packing foam and we'll both be riding the giant Roman candle out of here! What? Why would they put something so dangerous in here? I guess they didn't expect this room to be full of hazardous waste! Hmm. Hmm. Well, let us now we know. hopeful for a moment. Mm. What do we know? Now we know that the extinguisher and the foam create okay, an explosion. Yeah. <laughs> Are you thinking about the festival? Maybe. Or maybe there can be something done in ah, the room, you know, with the foam. Maintenance staff is Sorry? On the job. Uh, I mean, the room where you can create the foam when you use the foam. Hey, something's going on. Sorry to interrupt. Oh. Oh yeah, no, something. There is a stuck message. He took it Good and... Good for government work. Now he has it. The door is locked. He's leaving the room. Okay. Hey, where is he? We left earlier than he did. Now we can't see him. So sorry, you were saying we should combine the foam and put the oh, fire extinguisher on it? Maybe, but... Now I'm quite confused. It's the sophisticated and delicate mm. hub of all communications here in the Department of Death. Mm. Well, so maybe if we send in the fire extinguisher first, and then we send in the balloons and the phones. Maybe, but By can, the way, we can... only have one balloon left, I told you so. <laughs> can we... <laughs> Can we do that now, I mean? No, we only have one bill. Oh, we have two. We have two, that's good. Okay, so, let's do it. Dun -dun -dun. What if you spray... What if you use the fire extinguisher just on the foam? Yeah, I'm you? gonna do whatever you want me to. <laughs> it's gonna explode. Well, we can't die, can we? <laughs> well, not soon enough. That's not on fire. Okay. Mm -mm. So, anyway, 
Balloons. Select. Hmm. Good, now we have the first one. So, now there's a couple things we can do. First, let's find out if we can put the fire extinguisher in the tubes. That's true. Maybe we are thinking of something which can't be done, so... Let's find out. <laughs> Ta -da -da. That's so chilly. I think, yeah, yes, I think he has fixed the machine, so maybe there is no use of... Well, well he has fixed the machine, but like, what's... What's the point like? I know. No message in our room. Let's check out Domino's, just that we're here. What if there's no new messages? Yeah. Does he have it? No. No message here. I think Dom would yeah. call the company shrink if I left through the window. Oops, sorry. Yeah. Hmm. So we're gonna try and... My message tube is full of nothing. As usual. Hmm. The inventory is not very practical. Like it's nice, yeah. but it would be it would be great to see all the all items. All the things. It would be quicker, I think. Yeah. Well. <laughs> That's not on fire. Mm. Okay, so you can't do that. So there's two things we can do, Ginger. Here is thing A. We can um, we can repeat the thing with the machine, see if it, you know, what happens. Um, and thing B, we can go to the fair and try mm. to screw with the fair. I don't have a preference. Maybe we can try to go to, going to the fair? We can try that, yeah. Just uh, because we enjoy running back and forth. And when we are at the fair, we can always take, I mean, new balloons for you. <laughs> if you're exactly. so anxious. <laughs> and we need those, right? I have this kind of anxiety as well, but I have another one which always says what if there won't be enough room in my inventory and I will come... <laughs> I hate games that restrict inventory. Yeah. They say like it's more realistic. I mean seriously you're playing a game about yeah, a guy yeah, that's fireballing that's dragons true, to death true, and yeah. like it's not gonna be realistic? Are you serious? <laughs> By the way we're playing a game as a dead guy. So. Yeah. Anything is possible. What I'm going to do here is combine the phone. I don't really want to do that. Mm. Oh, dang. Hey. So you can do Maybe that. Maybe we can talk to him. We can give it to the phone, right? I don't really want to do that. Mm. I mean, what if there is. I have to go. That sound makes me want to kill what somebody. What if there is too? nothing left to do with the balloons? I mean, what if the balloons job is just done? And now we have to do something completely different, like... You mean Monty Python? Oh, <laughs> do something completely different. Oh, this, yeah. <laughs> no, I think the balloons job is not done. By the way, we can okay. check tomorrow. Maybe, so if we explode the messages... Mm. Maybe, maybe we can try and make... There has to be a reason that guy yeah. was... He has left with the message on him, so maybe if we... So if we see him the next time, if we yeah, see him we once can more... we take it from him. I know, let's try putting things in his pie post like bread and uh, everything <laughs> like I No idea, Ginger. Bread? But Eva said maybe before that the servers were stuck again. Maybe she knows now something more. Okay, well, you make me mm -hmm. do this. Come back and forth. Oh, I don't want to. No, just uh, <laughs> kidding. <clears throat> Manny, if you don't mind, I've got a lot oh, of filing here to do. Right, nothing. I do watch you. Oh, great idea, Ginger. Okay, sorry. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> I have stupid ideas all the time. So, let's start with the bread. So I'm thinking if we sort of like destroy the whole system, like if we make it explode, then what's going mm. to happen is he's going to say like, no more messages. 
And the last message he's got on He him. really filled the bread in it. He really did that. <laughs> we just crumbles. crumbles. <laughs> Which I don't know like if there's a benefit to that. Wow. Uh, maybe like maybe there's like an order we should use, like light, dark and uh I don't think so because what I you hope so. I hope not so. I, yeah. I oh my god. <laughs> Probably it's not that way, because I'd be like Wait, why would the bread fit in there? I don't know. Oh I think it would fit in there so that we can get crumbs actually as piece of inventory. Maybe later, yeah, in the game. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Where's the other one? So what happens if we put in a normal balloon? Probably won't fit, right? I won't, yeah, I think it won't fit. It doesn't have the shape. Alright. I'm gonna try the fire extinguisher. I mean, now. why would someone push bread and... <laughs> wow, he's <laughs> tough! Okay, now the foam is there again. I gotta oh. stop doing this. <laughs> it's okay, Manny. We make you do this. It's not your fault. <laughs> they made me do it. I hear these voices in my head. <laughs> and there's this clicking. It makes me That's do it. That's not on fire. Come on, use it. That's not on fire. Come on, That's use not on it. Fire. All right, Manny. Like you're terrible. You're not listening. I mean, what would happen if the thing would explode? What would Server's we get? Server's down from? again. What else? Is we know. New? Well, that's what I think is is what will happen is nobody will get any more messages. So no more clients. And the last client oh. is in the pocket of the guy. So it would go to us. Oh. Here he is again. Uh -huh. So now, do we want to use the fire extinguisher? Maybe. It's a little brutal. Maybe not, but like. Where is it? Maybe we'll talk to him yeah. first. I don't know. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, that's brutal. That's not on fire. Oh. Well, at least. That's not on fire. I'll just talk to him. Come on, man, worry. Walk him, walk back. I mean, he has the message hey, in his still not getting any messages. I'm giving you one right <laughs> now, but you can't see my hand. Oh, what do you mean? What do you mean by that? Hey, I'm still not getting any messages. I'm giving you one right now, but you can't uh -huh. see my hand. He means with a finger. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Ah, cheerful communications maintenance staff is on Can the job. Can we give him like Brad? Give him uh maybe he wants to play cards. I've already got one card out and I'm not deep in deck of cards just wouldn't help there. Damn I'm like I wish we could pickpocket him. Yeah. Give him a that food. wouldn't be a very good use of this special ceremonial bread. <sighs> Come on, Manny, I'm, hmm. out, I'm out of ideas. Like, there totally has to be something to do with There has to be something, yeah. I'm using this uh, dingo. Oh, okay. <laughs> Doesn't do anything. It, it maybe we have the thing because the sound intimidates some people. You know, Eva said she hates. But that was the shoes, no? Was it or was it a problem? I think it was the shoes, but we can try more balloons. Maybe he was lying about the shoes because he was. Balloons. Yeah, ashamed that he has the balloons with him. <laughs> it's a theory. Let's uh, explore it. Yeah. <laughs> no, not even the rhino. No. Um. Let's talk to him. Hey, I'm still not getting. I'm giving. 
Well, now there is a difference. Ah, we don't have all the options and... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Job. Like he's gonna be stuck here or can we close the door on him? Can we? No, it'd be a little brutal. You know, when you... Yeah. When you go there... Yes. There was... It's the wheel there were the more views. Not picking I that remember up. we, we saw the... Here? Red pipe. Oops, what was that? This one, yeah. Can we do something? No. I think that's the other end of Domino's message tube. Hey! Just get in there. Okay. We need to get in, but he doesn't want us to get in, so... I'm thinking if we could spray, like, the explosive in. Because wow. the red tube is not on fire, but it's red. It's probably not gonna use, uh, not gonna work. Just do it, Manny. Blow him up. That's not on oh. fire. Well, what if we went to Domino's office? We can't do that, can we? No. Well, we can try about the secretary yeah. one us. Well, what if we went there and? Oh, let's okay. Let's do it. Cause like, oh, 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 okay. Good enough for so, government work. Hmm. 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 Now he's got the message again, and he's leaving the machine room. Damn. So. <laughs> so it's not a message. It's some sort of blocker. Yeah. But here's what I'm thinking, Ginger, and I know how to do it. If we could. Like use a balloon and combine it with um, the fire extinguisher. Yeah, maybe. And then we combine yeah, it. We three can, balloons. Yeah, we can. But can you do this in this game? I'm not sure. We don't have the balloons. So I'm gonna select whatever, and I'm going to try to use it with an combine, item. Yeah. It's not gonna work. Hmm. So we're out of balloons. That's a pity. So if we do this thing with the balloons, the thing will break, of course. Yes. And he will come down. And there's something yes. we can do. And we need to get into Domino's tube for some reason. I don't yes. know what the reason is. Me neither. Damn, Ginger, we're stuck. Mm. <laughs> so let's explore the offices once more. So I pressed the boss Big in his boss office. Man doesn't want to hey, be there today. is a message? No. No, it was probably there before. Yeah. It looks like there's a message yeah. for Eva, but it was probably there. Wait, wait, what did she say? That the boss doesn't Big want to be Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed oh, sorry. today. I thought he was not in the office. Let's talk to Domino. Hey, Hurl. Yeah. Well, you sound pretty out of breath. So I'm gonna blow always a play. So that was fast. Can we get to his... Yeah, but he's gonna tell us to stay away mm -hmm. from it. Oh, sorry. I think okay. Dom would call the company shrink if I left through the window. No messages in Dom's fancy red tube. Hmm. He's got a lock on. Can't believe he he's doesn't gonna trust lock me. On. Not picking that up. So here's one thing, Ginger. If we put the bread in... It's going to create crumbles. Hmm. There has to be a reason for that. There has to be a reason, that's true. <laughs> I mean, why would the crumbles really? What are some of the things we can do? This is our tube, no news. My message tube is full of nothing, as usual. So let's put some more bread in there, just because we can pick up as much as we like. Yeah, that's true. <coughs> I'm sorry. It's really funny the way he sticks the bread there. It's a lot of crumbles, right? You know what's funny? He always keeps saying. Wow, that's really a stupid way to use the ceremonial bread, and now he's sending it. Yeah, 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 of course. <laughs> Dude, 
just to make Chrome Bros for nothing. Well, we know we need more balloons for sure. Yeah, we need. Because I wonder if there's like an order of things. Like we put hmm. first balloon, then a couple of brats, then our balloon, or like you know. I know. I just remember that when you combined the foams, it didn't really matter which one you put first. It always created the foam. Right. So. Well, we need more balloons anyway, right? Yeah. And maybe more bread. Maybe more bread. <laughs> so, like, the thing is, we know solution, like, the grand solution of how to yes. get more clients. Like, we know some possibilities, like get to Don's Tube or, um, or get to, like, Boss's office. Just take a so we know some of these to honor the dead. But what we don't know is what's the like connecting stuff. Just take here? a little more bread to honor the dead. I just take a little more bread to honor the dead. Oh, I'm giving him that the bread. That would be a very good use of this special no, ceremony. No, but sending it down bread. the tube really is a good use. My kid uh, wants another balloon animal. Jeez, what now? Do you have any more dead worms? Well, okay, I can skip the dialogue, so I'm gonna yeah. skip it because we know it by now. Okay, one more. That's not what balloons are for. What do you mean, one more? Like seven, seven more? Seven just more, to be on the safe, yeah, you're right. Safe side, right? <laughs> My kid died. Do you have any more? Well, shit. Like, here's the thing if we stop the messages from working, then the server becomes down, right? Yeah. And then if we enter the room, we can't leave the room before we do I something. Yes, that's true. Well, because if we leave the room, he's gonna leave the room as well. Yeah, with the thing in his pocket. I don't know if it's useful for us with that, but... So here's another thing, and I... My kid I don't know why, but the first time the guy caught on fire, why was well, that? Sure. Yeah, he did. I, I don't know. I think there were no crumbles. You think that's the reason? I don't My think that's the reason, but I can think There were no the crumbles, that's right. Well. Only difference I can think of. Well, I'm not sure if it's because So let me get that. one more balloon here. My kid died. Uh, do you have any more dead worms? You said that well, I'm fine. But yeah. still, we had the well, there's no chance to chat with to him. Five. Then there's hey. a limit. So I can only okay. have five. Okay. Which is okay, we're fine. Which is okay now, you know it. Yeah. And now that we <laughs> check out the crates, are completely crates. blocking the sidewalk. What if there were hmm. a fire? What if they were a fire, right? What if they were a fire? Why can I use the crates with... What if there were a fire? I mean, he says, like, maybe the, the crates don't even have to be set on fire, you know? What if they were on fire means people in there would be stuck and couldn't leave it because the crates are in their way. Maybe. Well, what if there were a fire? Aha! You know, in the festival right. there was a fire, what so maybe only the S. Yeah. How would we do that? Come on, no many you're running the other way. Maybe. Do we need anything else in the festival? I don't think so. I'm gonna look at the car again. Oh, I sold so many car travel packages when I was first starting out. So you are saying, Ginger, no crumbles in the in the pipe, right? I'm not sure. I just think that's the only difference. Well, you know what? Let's or maybe it go into the room and try to observe the machine a little bit more. Yeah. It's the sophisticated and delicate hub of all communications here in the Department of Death. That red right tube looks familiar. Hey, that the was not red tube looks familiar. That red tube looks familiar. Wow. So now if we go to Domino's... There may be a message. Maybe it was just uh, an animation, but like... Yeah, but it was only once there, so... Yeah, the second time it wasn't there. And the third time, yes. <laughs>
Oh, I don't see a flag. No messages in Dom's fancy red hmm. too. Hmm. Worth checking our computer just because we're here. Just in case. Maybe I need to close it. Well, I don't want to close this because I'm going to be using it in a second. I should close Bruno's record before the black mark burn into my screen. Okay, well, not really interesting. So you're saying... Oh, I, I, I need the phone. Sorry. Now it's a typical moment in adventure games, you're yeah. running back and forth like you, you almost have it, like you almost have it. Yeah. You have no idea. I have no idea. I mean, well, I have Me an idea. Either. I want to sit here on a couch. Can you do something with a couch? I mean... No. Um, Sorry, Mom. Okay. So, see these fans here? I'm thinking, is there any way we can use the fans? Hmm. I think we've already put some breadcrumbs in the tube though before. Yeah, but it was yeah, I, so we yeah. put we put so last time we put breadcrumbs in. Uh-huh. And then the foams. Yeah. But we didn't do it like you know, one, then breadcrumbs, then the other. No, we yeah, right. Which maybe doesn't have any effect. Maybe, but maybe it does, so we can try. You know, I'm thinking, the first time the guy caught on fire, maybe if he, like, gets caught on a bigger fire, he's, yeah. like, not gonna mind, like... Us esteemed, yeah. Right, Ginger. Hmm. If I knew, <laughs> I'd tell you. So my question is, can we find any way to use them from here? There must be oh, something else up. keeping it shut. The wheel won't turn and the door won't budge. There must be something, something else, else keeping, keeping it shut. Something else keeping it shut. Isn't it the message he, or what we thought was a message that the man has in his pocket? You know, what's keeping the door shut? That red tube looks familiar. Hmm. Can we check the door? I think that's like a like a card. Yeah. We actually cannot check the door. It's yeah, like, you are. You can't do that. Anything. Yeah, you can't do that. Oh, come back. Can't reach. Hmm. Can't, can't reach. reach. The sight. Not here. It will be. It would be pretty funny to send Domino the bags with the balloons with yeah, the material. <laughs> the Find phone. that he screwed the message. So what we're gonna do here is first try is going to be balloon bread balloon. Yeah, now there are two doses of right. breadcrumbs, so well we can try even. And then we're going yeah. to do um we're going to do um, just balloon and balloon like we did okay. the first time. Oh, sorry, I closed it. So. This, so this one is right? filled with a light chemical. Yeah. So which chemical first? This balloon is filled with a dark chemical. So let's try to reverse the order also. Okay. Why? Well, you know, I don't have a clue, but. <laughs> I think it doesn't matter, but we can try. So now the crumbs, right? Yes. You know, and when we are later crossing Eva, she tells us that the servers are down again. Maybe we can talk to her and... Sure. Maybe she can tell us something Now the other more. balloon, right? Yeah, the light chemical one. Ah. 
Come on, work. It seems to have done the same thing it always does. Can we close it now? Yeah, yeah let's close it. Just in case. Or maybe let's put the bread there because when he. Oh, there's no air pressure, right? <laughs> yeah, now there's no air pressure. So now we talk to Eva. Yeah. And we also talk to Don. Server's down just again. In case. What else is new? Manny, if. Right. I do watch you. Okay, she does. She won't tell us anything. Manny, if. Right. Oh, sorry. I do watch you. Okay. So let's try one door. Yeah. Hey, Hurl. Yeah. Well, you sound pretty out of breath, so I'm gonna blow. Mm. Always a pleasure, Cal. So nothing here. Can you check his tube? Uh, I don't think it's. No, his tube is not working. But I'm thinking, like, what else can we do with the bottle here? Can we use bread oh. with the bottle? Pour the liquid into the tube. <laughs> I mean, maybe if there's some that alcohol in there. a good use of this mm. special ceremonial oh, bread. Oh, no. I just want to pick it up. It doesn't work. Hmm. Mm. Yeah. I'm telling you there's going to be something with the bottle. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> so, what? Do you want to go down there or yeah, other room yet? I like, let's try know. the garage. Maybe. But I don't think there's going to be anything new in the garage. You're right. It's just, it's a little desperate by now. We can try, we can try anything. Like in Indy, when we combine anything with anything. <laughs> yeah, we just <laughs> never work. No one in there. No, hmm. let's, we need to solve that puzzle. So by we tried ourselves. a different combination of things, and then we can do balloon and balloon. We have so many options. Let's see what the guys is now. Because they're fixing it again. Now we have this weird view where we see yeah. the tube. The tube. And the fans are stopped. That's why I think maybe yeah, we can. The fans are stopped. That's true. Can we. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Go back, Manny. Hmm. No, Manny, go back. He just doesn't react to the tube. So let's try the sights. No. No, okay. Oh my god. Let's talk to the guy. He's hey, gonna tell us off again. I'm not getting any messages. I'm giving you one right now, but you hmm. can't see my hand. <laughs> Hey, that's what we had before. Can we? Hey, we can pick his pocket. Ah, oh, cheerful damn. communications maintenance staff. Mm. Hey, I'm still not getting. I'm... Can you look look at the door right now? I mean, why? It's the wheel on the door. Can you... the wheel won't no. budge? Not only not the wheel. Out. I mean, this part. Mm -hmm. so, no, no. Hey, I can look at the lock. Looks like it's not set. Okay. Not picking that up. I've yes. just locked an open door. Strange, yet symbolically compelling. So here is. Do you think if we leave, he will leave the door like open? Maybe, yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. Teacher, you're a genius. He knew it was about the door. He's taking the car. Good enough for government. He's leaving. Work. He's closing the door. Oh, it's yes. Open. Yes. Yes, Ginger. You did it. You knew all the time. Good. 
Now we don't have to combine all these. <laughs> maybe maybe we do have. To. Maybe we do, but it's good. Da, 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 da. Let's open it. Good. All right, we're in. Domino's tube. Watch. Oh, okay. Looks familiar. So we can send him. Oh. It's locked. It's locked. Are you kidding me? Really? Now we are here and it's locked. Because what I want to do is I want to send him like an explosive. Right? Yeah, right. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm joking. What? So the other thing is, if we put bread in now, we're going to get breadcrumbs. Maybe we can pick them up. We here. can pick them up, maybe, yeah. Oh, well, let's close the door, right? Just in case. Just in case. And what? can we go around the thing when we are no. in there? No. The one we're in there? Yeah. <coughs> Sorry. So cough. Too excited. No, I don't think oh. so. Hmm. Yeah, so what was it? Do some breadcrumbs, right? Breadcrumbs, yeah. Do you have watch in your hand? No. It's oh, I thought it was watch. Oh, it's beautiful. It's not. <laughs> it's for free. I got it from oh, it's, my. It's for free. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> nice. From my roommate. For free and nice. So breadcrumb time. I don't know what do we do with breadcrumbs. We put them in the whiskey and make him like choke. Yeah, maybe. But. <laughs> the bread goes into the pie. Okay. Breadcrumbs are created. I don't think we'll be able to pick those breadcrumbs up, you know? I don't think so. <laughs> because they're in the like core of it, the center. Yeah. Well, let's talk to this guy again. Hey, Hurl. Yeah. Well, you sound pretty out of breath. Mm. So I'm gonna blow. Always a pleasure, like, Here's Cal. the thing. If you want to use his computer, he's gonna use... Uh, and he's gonna say, what's your password? Yeah. Hey, Dom. What's your screensaver password? Get away from my computer, Manny. Maybe if he knew the password, I he... I think Dom would call the company shrink if I left Wouldn't the have to ask. And he would just use it. I'm not sure. So I'm gonna go down there again, and I'm going yeah. to... Check if there's breadcrumbs, but if there is not, let's talk to you. Manny, in case. if you don't mind. Right, I right. do watch you. <laughs> and so, what I think, if he's not, you know, in the garage, I'm gonna check the garage also. You know, where is the guy? Yeah, where is he? That's true. That red tube looks familiar. Not picking that up. It's locked. No breadcrumbs. Oh! It's the sophisticated and delicate hub of all the communications here in the Department of Death. As a rule, I never touch anything more sophisticated and delicate than myself. Not picking that up. Mm -hmm. So if the guy comes in, oh. he puts the passcode card there to. Yeah, yeah, you're right. We need the passcode card. I'm like thinking like we can make it explode somehow. Like if we can that red tube looks familiar. That red tube looks Do you think he will come back again? That's what I don't know, but probably yes. Yeah. Let's check the other rooms, if he's like in the other rooms. He must be, has to be somewhere. Here's more phone that we can Can we do something more here? No. No. For sure not. What about all the coffins? No, we can just... No, just this look one. Look yeah, this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah For those right. who enjoy no hassle travel. Yeah, I know. I don't need the hernia. Bruno, you in one of these? Must have picked them up already. Mm-hmm. 
I think the only purpose of this room is to combine the... I'm thinking real hard. The guy can be in the garage there with Glotus. Also, now the door is open. Like, what, mm. what has changed? We can read the two, but we don't know the yeah. passcode. <laughs> Maybe the boss is gone from the office? Maybe. Maybe we can open the window and... and yeah, maybe you he's... Know, do something from the roof? Yeah, maybe. Maybe he's gone when the... What's going on? Tubes are stuck. <coughs> I'm not sure. No, no, no. Well, like, we stuck the cubes and I then know. that gets him out of the room. Do you think so? Maybe because there's nothing to do. I I'm not sure. So we're but just trying to think so, guys. I know, it's just a theory of... So no breadcrumbs for us. No breadcrumbs and still the weird eye in the dead. But why does the bread go into the like tube? Maybe it will come in handy later? I don't know, I just... But still, if it would be for later, why would we get it so early in the game? So the only benefit that I think comes from the door not being locked is maybe if we do the thing with the balloons again. The drapes Sorry. are drawn. Dom must be in there napping. No use for it. There is one window with no curtains. The drapes are drawn. Dom must be in there napping. That's the boss's window. No, Domino's in there. What did he say? No, he's gonna see me? No way. No, Dom. If I go any farther, Dom will see me and call the staff shrink to come and talk me down. Can we Not while Domino's in something? there. Not picking that up. Alright, so we need to get him out of his office. So the only benefit I see to like doing all the exploding stuff again is that the door are open, yeah. so if we get there before the other guy, we can use the fire extinguisher. Wow, yeah, you're right. Well, that's what I I don't yeah. think I don't think it works like that. I think the guy is going to be there always. Um earlier than us. Yeah, because He's never shown coming there, so... No, the first time. Oh. Well, you know, the only thing let's we can try, try, really. Let's try, We still have to get the phones. <laughs> we still have the balloons. <laughs> I mean, really, <laughs> doing this for about the fourth or fifth time in his yeah, job. Yeah. But still, he has nothing to lose, I think, so... <laughs> no, nothing to lose, I yeah, well, uh, I mean, really, what? Well, he gets fired? So <laughs> no Can he get fired from this? I don't think so, so... I just, like, you know, I feel like, like I see the whole staircase in my head and there's, like, one little brick missing. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I just don't know what that brick is. Maybe now we should talk to Glottis, like it's really like full of maybes. Let's check on Dom while we're here, he's still here. Hmm. Like I'm really like, what do you do? So the bread comes will not work, so now we'll do the balloon thing all over again. Yeah. Um, it doesn't seem to matter whether, you know, first or second. Balloons go down the pipe post first from our office. One. You see this? Now it's open, but when we're standing next to it, it's not really open. It's not really open, you're right. And what if there's just a little bit of foam and then we use the explosive? Yeah, maybe. Or maybe what, not. I what know. if we don't send the explosive through the tube, but use it right there when we are there? Let's try, we have two more balloons. Well, we have to use only the other one, I think, to pour it. Yeah, that's right. You know what? And you don't mean from the office, right? No, no. Directly. No. Yeah, directly. All right. Mm, let's see. And then use the fire extinguisher. Yeah. So that way we'll be there before the guy is there, right? Yeah. Because we're staying there. But still, why would there be the thing with the red... You know, when we destroy all the tubes. So let's try the fire extinguisher first. What do you mean, think with the red? Uh, there's the red tube and... I know, that's the, not on fire. 
our goal is to destroy... To open it. Yeah, to open it. Well, maybe we just exploded two. We use this with the tube. I don't want to do that. Come on, I don't money. Really do that. Oh. So here's what I'm thinking, Ginger. Yeah. Right. I don't really want to do that. Oh, come on, Manny. Look at the pipe. That red tube looks familiar. When we look at the pipe, if we put the card there, we can block the message. Yes. But we don't have a card or anything that's reminiscent of the card. Do we have any? Oh! We have the book? Yeah, we, yeah, we have we a have card. We have one we have. Oh. Yes, we have the card. Good, we have it. Death, yada, yada, yada. Aha, positive attributes. Volunteer time oh. reading stories to dying children. <laughs> That's good. That's really good. Okay. I think you're it, Mercedes Colomar. <laughs> I think you're the one for me. Good. Oh my god, here we go. We're wow, dressed. Wow, that was a nice idea. Are you loco? What got into you? <sighs> Alright, new car. car. Oh, yeah. And it's even better company now! It's a race car now, like Mario Kart. <laughs> with fire sprayed on the side. Yeah, with fire blazing. That's fantastic. Oh, and the fire is everywhere. And the fossil of the other guys. Woo! We're going for Mercedes because wow. we're at her address. See you, Domino. <laughs> wow. And Gladys is like, his head, his tongue is hanging out. Flying in wind. Buenos dias. You're not the nurse? Oh, she's beautiful. No. You're she not looks here like to a skeleton. Give me my medication? No, but I am here to ease your pain. Guess they couldn't save me, huh? No, but there's still a chance you could save me. <laughs> That's a lot of responsibility, Mr. Calavera. Back in the office. What makes you think I've been all that good? Miss Colomar. Meche, please. Meche, I can see it in your face and in your file here, where it says you're entitled <laughs> to a first-class ticket to... Nowhere? What? Did I do something wrong? Not according to your bio. It was spotless. At least the part I read was. I'm not sure I like the implication, Mr. Calavera. Okay. Oh, the only right. implication here is that I'm fucked. So, so sorry, Ginger, I'm just gonna step in here a little okay, bit sorry. because yeah, I don't know yeah, if, yeah, 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 you're if, right. if everybody Definitely. got the whole scene. So right. what happened is there is the air tube, the the the, the pipe post, right? And we've stuck a card in there that has blocked the message. And I think we were lucky that we have punched the card before, so yes. it didn't stop the air. Definitely. It just stopped the message. Yeah. And we could read the address and, you know, uh, details about Micha, the, the girl. And and so then, um, you know, obviously we went for her. There was Glottis in this super cool racing car that, you know, had fires out of it. And now we're, we're here in the office with... Mercedes Colomar. Okay, so we have a few options to tell her. The first thing is the only implication here is that I'm fired. <laughs> the second one, are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? The third one is anything about your past you haven't told me. Or the fourth one is, excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess <sighs> out. Uh, I don't want to straighten this mess out. I want to chat with her. Are you sure you're Mercedes Colomar? Yes. Would you like to see my birthmark? You don't have any. Sure, where is sure. it? <laughs> where is it? It's wherever you guys put my skin. <laughs> oh. That was brutal. Anything about your past you haven't told Anything me? Anything about your past you haven't told me? Quite a bit, considering I've told you nothing. <laughs> Did you kill much when you were Did alive? Did you kill much when you were alive? Very little. Never killed never anybody? Kill anybody? I have to confess, I never killed anybody. Alright. Not even a no, teensy <laughs> bit of killing? Maybe I just wasn't trying hard enough. Were you a big shoplifter? Were you a mean big to animals? shoplifter? Sorry. Well, they accused me of it <laughs> once. Really? But it wasn't my fault. That puppy followed me out of the store. <laughs> oh. Okay, mean to animals, ever cheated on your taxes, ever cheated on your husband, or oh, I give up. Mean to animals? Oh no, I love animals. Once, when I was volunteering at an animal shelter, I... Just <laughs> stop right there. 
<laughs> Ever cheated on your taxes? I've never paid taxes in my life. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> I've never made enough money to be taxed. You know, it's mostly oh. been all volunteer work. Uh huh. She's a saint. Ever cheated on your husband? Mr. Calaveda, there's no ring on my finger. There's no skin on uh -huh. it either. I guess you'll just have to <laughs> trust me then. Litter. Litter. Oh, Manny. Is that the best you can do? Work with me. Give me some dirt. Work with me, Mechi. Give me some dirt. Well, I could do something bad right now if that would help. Wouldn't count. Sorry. I give up. Don't say that, Manny. Excuse me, but I have to go straighten this mess out. Sorry to be so much trouble, Mr. Calavera. It's no trouble, but please, call me Manny. Oh, she's right. still sitting here in our office. Yeah, so what we're going to do here is we're going to save. Definitely, yeah. Save game slot four and save game slot one just in case. <laughs> and then I think we're, we're already, what, two hours, 19 minutes? Okay. Which is fair. <laughs> so we're going to make a first video here. Um, okay. We may come back again. But uh, it's a nice kind of progression in the story. Definitely. Guys, um, she's Ginger. Yeah, and this is Glasses. And we're playing Grim Fandango on Pixabee.